every day before I went to work Remembering her smile is far from home made it worse Now I feel like I've welcomed this hearse Tears have now become a delicate curse One day I returned home, she got a call from mom Now she's sick of being alone I smelt the booze and the bottle and the vodka full throttle Her right hand swung and she hit me in the eye Struck her back, she felt the sigh Shock and unnerving feeling. Maybe it was her spirit as it floated to the ceiling. Her skin is white as the ghost she was now. I felt the devil stare at me with a feeling so proud. She was my light, my path, and I'll never let go. So I grabbed the needle and thread and began to sew. Her corpse was bland, so I carved out a smile, took her to my bedroom before she started to rot and have my way for a while. Careful injections of formaldehyde to keep you looking beautiful. Lighting candles for our dinner date. I'll make sure you eat your plate full. Cake makeup to make you look like a horror. Oh, babe, that's just gonna make me want you more. Girl, you become such a good listener. I can't stop kissing her. Put your lips on mine. Your wretched aroma is damn fine. I use bobby pins to tighten you up so we can always picture out buzz When we first made love, let's get married, the whole shebang, including the doves It would be just me and you, I hope, because I sent a letter to your parents saying we eloped Your arms now look like a stick in a burlap sack, but I'm stuffed your chest with leftovers to keep up your nice rack By the next day, it reeks like hell, the smell no longer dormant from this house like jail cell A few minutes later, the cops were called, soon to the psychiatric jail I'd be hauled so I grabbed your preserved heart and a piece of your hair, flesh and bone, and put it in my mouth and swallowed it whole. I started to choke, flopped over, and croaked. The last thing I felt was your bony, rotted hand. I used to take care of them, it made me a man. The police opened the door, puked from the smell, saw it was on the floor. A skeleton and her decomposed spouse, forever and ever condemning this house.